I have the Samsung Galaxy A54 5G and I'll be showing you how to screenshot on this phone. Now I'll show you different methods of screenshotting. So maybe one or two or even three, maybe even all of them will work for you. So the first method I'll show you is using the side key plus volume down. And what you need to do is press these two buttons once and release, but you have to do that simultaneously. Okay, so side key plus volume down. So go ahead and press once and release. That takes a screenshot and you can see the screenshot toolbar at the bottom for cropping, sharing and deleting. So let's do that again. So side key plus volume down, that will take a screenshot. Okay, another way you can take screenshots is by using the edge panel. Now these phones come with an edge panel here. So you can bring out the edge panel and look for the screenshot icon. If you don't see it or you don't see the edge panel, simply go to settings. On the main settings page, go to display and then under display, go to edge panels and make sure edge panels is enabled first of all. And then with the edge panels enabled, which you can also do from here, go down to panels and then make sure the tasks panel is among the panels. So this one is very important. So add tasks. Uh, just to make sure that tasks panel includes the screenshot, tap on edit. And then you should see it takes screenshots is there. So that's fine. Now, if you want to keep the default uh, uh, edge panel, you can leave it there or you can uncheck it to remove it so that you only remain with the tasks edge panel. So now on the edge panel, you can bring it up, tap on take screenshots and that will take a screenshot anytime. Okay. And you can do this from any screen. So let's, for instance, go to the home, to the settings page, uh, bring up the edge panel and tap on take screenshots. And that should take a screenshot on your phone. You can also do the legendary palm swipe screenshot. So just swiping your palm on top of the screen like that takes a screenshot. Okay. And you can do it on either side. So as you can see, every time I do it, it takes a screenshot. For that to work, you have to enable it in the settings. So go to settings. Under settings, go to advanced features. And then go to motions and gestures. And then at the bottom there, make sure palm swipe to capture is enabled. Okay. If it's disabled like this, then you'll not be able to take those uh, palm swipe screenshots. So make sure that is enabled. I'll show you another way of taking screenshots. That's by using the shortcut icons when you pull down uh, from the top of the screen twice to reveal the shortcut icons. Look for take screenshot. Now, if you can't find it, just go to the last page and tap on the plus icon and then look for uh, the screenshot option. Here it is, take screenshot. So tap on, I mean, long press on that up, uh, icon and then drag it to this section and release and then tap on done. Now that icon has been added to the shortcut icons. So now when you pull down and pull down again and look through, you'll find take screenshot. You can tap on it and it's gonna take a screenshot of whatever it is that's on your screen. Now, if you're on any scrollable page, then you can actually go ahead and take a scrolling screenshot. So let's say you're on a page like this, which is a settings page, and you want to take a screenshot of the entire page. Obviously it does not, it does not fit in one frame on the screen. So you have to take a scrolling screenshot. Now you can take a, a screenshot using any of the methods I've just shown you. Just take, just use any of the methods to take a screenshot. But as soon as you take the screenshot in the screenshot toolbar, you should see this little icon. And if you tap on it, it allows you to take a scrolling screenshot. So let's do that again. Uh, side, take a screenshot and then look at the toolbar. You can tap on that icon and it's going to scroll for you and continue capturing until the end of the page or until when you're happy, then you can tap on the screenshot itself and then use either gallery or whatever the app you're using to open. And here's our scrolling screenshot. Okay. So that's basically how to take a scrolling screenshot. All screenshots are saved in the gallery. Okay, so you can always go to gallery and find your screenshots there. 
there's also a special album for screenshots if you go to albums you can find a special album where all the screenshots are saved in one folder and that's basically how to take screenshots and also scrolling screenshots on your galaxy a54 5g thanks for watching leave your comments and questions down below and good luck